Kate Middleton collapses over Prince William cheating scandal. Did Kate Middleton collapse over Prince William allegedly cheating on her with family friend Rose Hanbury? That's what is being reported in one of this week's celebrity magazines. The claim, however, is completely untrue. According to The Globe, tormented by fears, her husband cheated and her royal marriage can never be saved. Middleton worked herself into such a frazzled state during the trial separation that she collapsed on a bathroom floor inside her parents' home. The supermarket tabloid asserts Middleton has grown frailer from barely eating and sleeping for more than two weeks. To back up its premise, the outlet trots out a so-called royal insider maintains she has been picking at her food. The anonymous source adds how everything came to a head after Middleton locked herself in the bathroom at her parents' house where she could be heard weeping hysterically. The supposed tipster contends after failing to appear an hour later, her mom knocked on the door but got no response and so she used a key to open the door of the bathroom where she found Kate crumbled in a heap. After her mother was able to revive the Duchess of Cambridge, William and Doctor were called claiming the tabloids insider but when Middleton saw her husband she began crying and screaming and he ultimately left curiously the often discredited magazine doesn't mention when Middleton collapsed or how it's literally the only outlet in the world to have learned this the truth of which the tabloid doesn't seem terribly concerned about is that Middleton never fainted or crumbled in her parents home nor she has been recently tormented or frazzled as evidenced by the photo taken earlier in the week. Simply, the publication has been adding a new fictitious chapter every week to its ongoing tale about the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge. Two weeks ago, it wrongly claimed Prince William and Middleton were in divorce talks. That was followed last week with yet another concocted piece about Middleton having moved out on Prince William during a trial separation. Of course, as Gossip Carp previously noted, Prince William and Middleton are not in a trial separation, nor are they consulting divorce attorneys. In fact, lawyers for the royal family have dismissed infidelity reports as false speculation, but instead of cutting its losses and abandoning its phony narrative, the tabloid did what it does best, which is create an untrue article about a royal having unexpectedly collapsed. Last August, with the help of some photoshopping, the Globe manufactured a bogus cover story about Queen Elizabeth having collapsed after hearing Prince Philip had cancer, a diagnosis that has never been confirmed by any legitimate outlet. The article from 270 days ago mistakenly swore up and down that Prince Philip had only 90 days to live. With presumably the success of that story on newsstands, the same habitually disproven publication insisted Queen Elizabeth collapsed again after Meghan Markle started a family war over Christmas. But as Gossip Cop noted back then, when the tabloid printed its tale about the supposed Christmas fire, the holidays hadn't actually begun yet, and none of the royals were even at Sandringham when the argument allegedly took place. In fact, the only thing that collapsed on, upon closer inspection was the outlet's claim. The reality is far from being estranged from the royal family. Middleton continues happily representing it at various charity functions, including attending Wednesday's opening in London of a new facility at Anna Frode Centre, which is devoted to the mental health of children. Most significantly earlier in the week, Queen Elizabeth personally made Milton a damn grand cross of the Royal Victorian Order, which is the highest honour that can be bestowed by Her Majesty as a thank you for the Duchess's work on behalf of the monarch. Once again, the only ones cheated are the readers of that tabloid who are weakly fed false reports.